Welcome to my channel. I'm glad you're here. This is a channel where we can openly discuss race and ethnicity, hopefully from the most neutral point of view possible, which is hopefully mine. I, I strive for that at least. But today I want to discuss Zach Morris. Yes, Zach Morris from Saved by the Bell. Recently I did a video talking about how A.C. Slater, played by Mario Lopez, on the show Saved by the Bell, ultimately was culturally white. And when I say culturally white, that's a phrase that a lot of people outside the United States struggle to understand. But to put it in perspective, think about the cast of Saved by the Bell. Mario Lopez, the actor who plays A.C. Slater, was an American of Mexican descent, yet he never seemed to speak Spanish. His name wasn't Spanish sounding. Nothing about him culturally seemed any different than the rest of the kids at school. He was culturally white. And so now I want to talk about Zach Morris, the by default main character of the show. I recently watched a clip uh, of Mark Paul Gossler, who played Zach Morris, and he said in the clip what I've known for years. He himself said that he is half Asian because as he explains, his mother is Indonesian and his father is of Dutch heritage. So Mark Paul Gossler said, quote, Zach Morris is half Asian. And it is true, he's biracial. Mark Paul Gossler, who is Zach Morris, even with the, and he talks about how they, they bleached his hair blonde to make him look like this California kid. But the whole time he was half Asian, biracial. And I think that's interesting because I think if that show were made today and Zach Morris was played by Mark Paul Gossler, who was, you know, let's rewind in time. I'm just saying not if he was in his 40s, but if he was still a teenager now, if it was remade now and today in 2018, I think that they would totally bring attention to the fact that Zach Morris was biracial. But on the show, he wasn't biracial. His parents were both of European descent. So I, I, I think that today they would get some mileage on that and, and, and bring that up, make, make a deal out of that. But no, in the late 80s and early 90s when the show premiered, Zach Morris was a white kid from California with blonde hair and played by a biracial actor. And I know that the, the term biracial is thrown around a lot here lately and it's like, are they really biracial? <laughs> but when your father is white and, and he describes his mother as a tiny little Asian lady, that's what he says. He was biracial. And so as far as being, again, talking about characters on Saved by the Bell being culturally white, Zach Morris was definitely culturally white and it wasn't until him saying that that people even realized, wow, that's kind of weird. Zach Morris is half Asian. But don't, don't you agree though, if that, if that show premiered now, they would totally bring light to the fact that he's half Asian. That would be a good way to include diversity on TV. But it was all lost on us the whole time because it appears that any traces of ethnicity beyond European were just downplayed or altogether ignored on Saved by the Bell. So we've talked about A.C. Slater. We've talked about Zach Morris. The next video I'm going to do, I want to talk about Lisa Turtle, played by Lark Voorhees, as we explore this concept of white culture in America. Thanks for watching.